ladies and gents, the weapons are here. The unique exotic tier of weapons are here in this reset in the Anthem Cataclysm update. And I must say, these weapons are actually worth it. You can get them as drops from Cataclysm enemies or from the Cataclysm vendor. Now, please keep in mind that if you decide to get it from the vendor, it will cost you one major shards or 200 minor shards. So those are some other things that you may want to think about. Right now, we are taking a look at Gravedigger, which is one of the Pulse Accelerators. This weapon is a beam rifle that deals intense fire damage. You hold down the trigger and it starts torching the enemies and setting them ablaze. Few seconds into the trigger pull though, you will also notice a ramp up in damage and in fire rate, which is something that I think is going on. The one that I have deals about 1400 base damage per tick and because it is an elemental weapon, the enemy actually takes damage the longer you stay on them. That's the effect of that damage over time that you will get with fire elements within the game. So what makes this weapon special other than the usual brim rifle and looking cool? Well, the answer is going to be focused fire. Because the damage can be controlled and pointed and directed, this means that it will be great for certain bosses and apex enemies. Depending on your role, you can continuously stagger some enemies, which is also a great thing. Imagine facing a titan and it opens a chest up and you just point it right there and just keep it on that chest. You can deal some amount of crazy damage. But I also must say, this is the first time in the game that I actually thought to myself, man, I could really use some ammo. And that's one of the things that you will notice in this weapon. Being that a trigger method is continuous, you are burning ammo like crazy every time you fire it. Luckily, it does come with a perk called Pulse Accelerator Ammo and you might find that in some of the rolls that you get. And we also have some sigils and components for the ammo of this weapon as well. Other than the ammo economy, this is a great weapon that you really need to farm. You need to get your hands on this. And because we can now change the weapons anywhere in the game easily, you can swap back and forth between weapons when it comes to bosses or different enemies. And all these weapons also use the same ammo, which is something that a lot of people do not appreciate when it comes to Anthem. If you look at Warframe, if you look at Destiny, if you look at Division, a lot of these weapons in those games use different ammo. However, in Anthem, it's the same ammo, which is something that I hope that they don't change. But anyways, ladies and gents, expect more weapon reviews today. We have more of them coming because I've been getting a lot of them as well. But as always, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.